Here at night, yo, we here. You see that little right ad? Up. It say zero zero. It ain't gonna be that at the end of the game. We come to work. Come to work, baby. Yeah, man. Yeah. No talking. No, this shit oh, get like. Yo. It's a different dog from last year, man. You watching exclusive productions. You watching exclusive productions. Exclusive productions. Let it eat. Wait, get up field. Press the left arm. There you go. That's it. First quarter, then the second quarter, then the third, then the fourth. 48 fucking minutes of hard nosed football. Feels good, all right? Yes, sir. Discipline. Break it down, bro. Let go. Hey, be loud. Be loud. Hey, man. Fuck a patron. Fuck a creep. Hey, you gonna clap? You gonna fuck up, boys? I'm gonna click clap. Boom. Click clap. Boom. The GHSA logo is heads. The football on the back is tails. I'll flip it heads up. You want heads or tails? You want heads? Heads. Already called heads. It is tails. So syndicate you won the toss. She was far you won the first. Alright, Blues won the toss, they was the first. <laughs>
point than they did and that's all that matters man it, it it didn't look the way we needed it to look man but at the end of the day we challenged the kids in the locker room at halftime man and they came out and played man so hats off to them um, we just got to be consistent across the across 48 minutes man and I think if we can do that consistently man we're gonna be a tough team in the playoffs a lot of it was man we you know we, we don't lose at home man so um, and our kids understand that they know that um, but we just challenged them man like are you gonna let somebody come in your house and, and, and take your belongings? You know what I mean. So we challenged them, and they and they uh you know they they responded, and that's that's good to see. That was good to see coming out, uh, especially coming off a of bye, like you said. A, a, a lot of things we need to correct, uh, but you know we'll get it figured out before next week. We just got to be consistent, man. Consistent at practice, consistent in the classroom, consistent in the weight room. That's the biggest thing with our guys, teaching them consistency across the board. Uh, because if you have cons consistency across the board, it's going to show up on Friday nights, man. And that's what we're trying to preach to them because they consistent out here. They consistent in the classroom. Uh, you know, they're going to be consistent in life. You know, and that's, that's it's bigger than football with some things, man. So we want to try to teach them that, teach them those lessons and, and uh, you know, try to move forward, man. This is Coach Smiley, head coach at Sandy Creek High School. You're watching exclusive productions. I'm feeling good. Came out in the second half. Do what we had to do to get the win. Uh, going going into the uh, half, I'm I'm thinking I got to be the difference. I got to be a dog. I got to make something happen, even if nobody even if nobody else is. So that's all it was. I just feel like we need to take practice more serious. Some days we don't be fully locked in. I feel like if we lock in, we'll have better games and come out with easier easy not not want to say easier wins, but like higher level wins. This is Amari Latimer, Sandy Creek High School, and you're watching Exclusive Productions. Uh, it was a slow start, but you know we got the job done to get another um, home game. So for the next week, you know, it's when to go home. I feel kind of mixed emotion about it because we should have blew them out. We should have played a lot better than we did just because of the opponent that we had. But we definitely should have played a lot better, but I'm glad we came coming home with the W. So we was basically just telling each other to stay calm. I was telling myself to stay calm, get out of my head. I was telling my teammates what 
where to go, where to go, uh, where not to go, just because we was missing a lot of plays early on in the game, down on the uh, end zone, in the red zone. But I basically, we basically went through it and we told each other to lock in, let's get this W, come back, protect the house. We just need to work on executing. We need to work on getting the ball down, winning third downs, winning fourth downs, going down and getting the end zone. Punch the ball in the end zone every time. It's happened the whole, all the games during the season, we haven't been able to finish. We've gotten down there, we just haven't been able to finish. If we be able to finish and the defense stay strong like they are, we'll be able to go back. This is Damon Pinson, athlete for Sandy Creek High School, and you're watching Exclusive Productions. Boom!